you're gonna get familiar with the truck to really do a good job. We haven't had it for the last two years. We all know why, but to tell you the truth, they really couldn't wait to have this again. I see uh, quite a few people that are excited about being here. I've done it for six, eight years now, and I'm learning every year, too. We're trying to simulate real world situations where we're plowing and cleaning up and you got to get as close as you can without hitting something. To get here, you have to be a pretty good driver. There's not much room to pick up any speed at all. We try to take speed out of all of it. It's, it's a skill event. So I like to make it as tough as possible. Like The truck will fit, but it has to be planned out ahead of time or you will hit a cone or you'll hit a board. Those plows can can do a lot of damage. Here, if you break a block of wood, big deal. If you hit a cone, it's not gonna hurt anything. There's a little flag on some sticks and they just have to touch the flag. If they touch anything else, it's points. So you don't want points. If the rail falls off, that's 10 points. You go for a low score like golf, zero is a perfect score. Nobody gets a perfect run. Right up for right up from the floor, see it? Person in the passenger seat is running the controls for the wing. It is a lot of, about teamwork. It's communication. Your wing a little bit straight. We put them in situations where you need to rely on your passenger. The whole time, you know, he's got to tell you if you need to get tighter to a cone, or in or out, or up or down with the wing. And I like to make it fun. I like to make it challenging. And at the end of the day, you walk away, and it might be something you never thought a truck could do before. And you can say, wow, I've got, I actually pulled that off. Some of the drivers today have only worked for us for less than a year. There's a lot of great things that come out of this. Put the name in and sign up and try it.